Hello kitties, we are going to read a book about at the zoo. Welcome to the zoo. Elephants and monkeys live in this big area of the zoo. African elephants have large ears to help them cool. Elephants spend between 12 and 18 hours a day eating. Mandrill monkeys store food in pouches in their cheeks. The mandrill is the largest type of monkey. The pygmy marmoset is the smallest. These animals are often called big cats and live in a special area of the zoo. The stripes in every tiger are different. A tiger roaring can be heard two miles away. A lion's roar can be heard five miles away. Lions live in groups called prides. Only male lions have manes. This is to show other rival males how strong and fit they are. In their natural environment, these animals live in very cold parts of the world. Polar bears have black skin. This helps absorb the sun's warmth. Their fur appears white to help them blend into a snowy environment, making it easier to hunt. Penguins live in large groups to help protect them from predators. Penguins slide around the ice on their bellies. It's faster than wandling and it's great fun too. These animals live in a grassy area of the zoo. Giraffes get so much water from the leaves they eat that they only need to drink every few days. Rhinos grow to their big and bulky size just by eating grass and plants all day long. Zebras can run up to 65 kilometers per hour. This area of the zoo is hot and wet, much to the climate of a forest. Every species of frog makes different sound. Frogs can use their very sticky tongues to catch food. There are over 300 different types of parrots. Many parrots are known for copying sounds, including human voices. In the wild, their clever sounds can warn each other about danger. So that's it, littles. You've learned about animals in the zoo. Bye!